Meat got trucks, man. He's one of them people. You know what I mean? Just need to hold that and be like, stop. Stop painting. painting. Yeah. Stop posting. He just jumped on the bandwagon of this Ghost Rider thing and maybe it was a joke. He was never ready for that beef, though. Because you don't think a guy who sings on tracks about, you know, women that don't want him no more is ever going to really come for you like that. If you're going to come back, you got to come You come back hard, isn't it? Drake is just a perfect example of follow through. People probably yeah. never thought that their meme would ever make it to a Drake concert. Like, they probably didn't make it to the Drake concert, but they were there in spirit. Boxy Malone! Oh, one six one. Oxy Malone has been trying to put Manny on the map for so long, and it's not working because Chipmunk keeps hurting him. Who started that beef? To my knowledge, yeah, Chip did a whole like fire in the booth or whatever, cuss tiny from like way back when, and then everyone thought he was a mug, and then. Bugsy sent for him and then it just got long after that, do you know what I mean? And then, yeah, and then Bugsy thought, oh yeah, like, cool. And then Chip responded, like, a few months later, but with three, but five months, but then, but with three, three banging tunes, yeah. And then he came back with some dead thing, yeah. And then he finished him again and again, and then one last time, and then come, it's done. Right, so Manny's yeah. not on the map, yeah. innit? Sorry, Ten Bugsy. Reporting for <laughs> trap, 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 trap. I enjoyed it. I liked the competitive nature of them. I similarly, with other people, would like to see both of them, you know, put it to bed and just bring out music. Yeah. It's been a South London cleanup, as it we saw been. at the Mobos. We've got so many good platforms in place that are really about furthering and advancing these artists who, for the longest time, were told that the music that they make isn't music. Because we have the Link Ups, the Grime Dailies, it's just a recognition of artists that make music in the most adverse circumstances. I feel like the reason that music can is like called not real music is because it's a language. It's like it speaks to like people from that have grown up in those circumstances. Now everyone else on the outside really wants to get in. But they because what exactly, they believe because the grime they industry is kind do. of just carried on moving on its own. The grime scene has come together so much this year, yeah. supporting each other in every way and I think that's been like one of the main reasons why it's blown up so much. And it's not just been grime as well, because we've seen an emergence of R&B talent, like the Shackers, Jermaine Riley, and even down to, you know, groups like Western, who at one point were mm. battling it out with Adele for a number one spot, like. Why haven't you guys watched Straight Outta Compton? Nobody wants to go to the No one wants to definitely Let's go, let's, let's go, let's together. go. Let's go together. Let's go after this, guys. We'll all go watch Straight Outta Compton. I have as well. Yara for NWA. Was, was a postcode. <laughs> <laughs> that will be the joke of the year. Let's into contact. <laughs> like this. this was a couple of weeks ago, yeah. Okay. Okay. That's it. <laughs> <laughs> it's actually very. It's a very touching movie. When you see it in your face, the way that they depicted it, it was, it was educational. It was so moving, and like it's crazy to think how people lived at that time. You know, with police brutality. I thought the movies like that are always pretty inspiring and you know it gives you a better insight into like you know the history of like urban music and stuff like that. Like, I was waiting for Shaka. I made my what Lost Boys is up now? Lost, what, yeah it was <laughs> but I pre-ordered it on the 29th on the 31st of September and I was waiting. He changed the date three times and three times I watched the I date change. I doubt he did it on his own accord. I think it's probably it's label, 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 label politics. Like label logistics. What about Frank Ocean? Like Frank don't care about Where you. Where is he? Frank don't care about you. Frank don't care about you. Frank don't care about Frank you. Frank does care about me, about me man. If Frank cared, Frank would have dropped the thing right now. You don't know what's going on with him, but don't make promises you can't keep, bro. Just, just don't say. Just don't and tell us. Yeah, album coming. Him and Rihanna. Yeah, every day album soon come. Album soon come. Rihanna has the album coming out, but I think album, she said that she Rihanna doesn't brought read, out her she's not happy with it. So I'll give her that. I'll give it to Rihanna because she had been consistent in terms of consistent in a weird way though, like. Seven years, seven albums. She said she's not happy with her work, and I feel like it's easy for us to get hyped about albums, but we have to appreciate when the artist isn't feeling it. So yeah. maybe Frank Ocean isn't feeling all his tracks. I feel like Adele doesn't think of names for her album. She just. <laughs> <laughs> all she does is pick, pick two numbers.
numbers are thrown on the album it's title. Eight, and I think it's, it's lazy. Eight, isn't it? it's is she 25? No, she's not. She's 27. Is that she's not even the age of well, her album? Yeah, yeah. She's, she's never the age that she is of the albums. You know that, right? They're milestone okay. ages, but um, I know in the most recent one, it was quite touching what she wrote. About, it was beautiful. Um, yeah, what about she wrote about ages, the age yeah. of, and waiting for certain things to happen in her life. And now just kind of saying, she just wanted to be happy and just yeah. enjoy the moment. And I think Adele's one of those artists, like, you don't hear about her anywhere. Yeah, yeah. She's doing nothing but looking after her kid or kids or how many other kids she has and making music. But when she comes out, she comes out with a bang, 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 banger. For me, I don't know. Um, I found Hello is a beautiful track, but it was just like Adele being Adele. Yeah. It was just like, yeah, okay. That's it from us. Thank you so much for watching. We'll be taking the conversation to Twitter using the hashtag BusStopFans. Let us know what episode is your favourite by dropping us a tweet. Bye! Bye. 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 Bye.